Hey guys, welcome back to yet another Tech Tip Tuesday here on the Motion Raceworks YouTube channel. We're back with a lot more Tech Tip Tuesdays and we're excited to uh, bring some knowledge to you guys. Today, we're gonna talk about a very important part. Uh, it's on basically every aftermarket and race car out there on the planet and it's pressure sensors. Uh, more importantly, some tips and tricks to make them last longer and function better and be more accurate. So let's get to the point of today's Tech Tip Tuesday. We're talking about mounting orientation. Both in fluid and air situations, you have the potential to mount these in a way that corrosion and damage can happen to the sensor if they're not mounted correctly. Take for instance this, you have an entrance, you have a diaphragm built in, um, AKA the sensor, and then you have the electronics. So obviously mounting can matter. Um, when you have fluid coming in, if you are mounting these um, whether they're on the engine or if they're mounted externally, mounting these in a way where fluid or air, which creates condensation, can allow that fluid to sit in here, opens you up to problems in a variety of aspects, one of them being corrosion, uh, one of them being losing accuracy of sensor. You know, that diaphragm, if you think about it, is a piece of material that's gonna be stretched or moved. So if it's got the weight of the pressure at zero, um, you can run into some issues depending on the design. And the same thing goes for these Rife sensors. The sensor is essentially uh, oriented like this in the sensor. So when you're mounting them from scratch, you wanna mount them so they're down and so they're down. Basically what that does is allows any condensation, any type of uh, foreign fluids which can corrode, eat away at the diaphragm, whatever, to drain out when it's not actively being used. Especially in situations where you're storing it or it's sitting for any period of time, that can be detrimental to the life of the sensor, the accuracy of sensor, and the functionality overall. So one little tip and trick, you know, if you're going to mount this on the firewall, Mount it like that, don't mount it like that. Mount it like that, don't mount it like that. It's that simple. It's something that can save you a lot of money because we all know no matter what brand sensor you're buying, they're not cheap and they're the most inconvenient thing to fail because if you get to the track and one of them's dead, it's gonna cost you some money and it's gonna maybe ruin your whole day or weekend. So hope that helps you guys as you're mounting sensors and building plumbing systems and everything else in between. It's free, use that tip and it'll uh, help your stuff last longer and function better. If you have ideas for the next Tech Tip Tuesday, don't forget to drop them down in the comment section below. We love to hear from you guys. That's how we get ideas just like this one. And we'll see you next time.